What's good, people? <laughs> I'm out here in these streets. You know how I do, man. Um, so I'm out here repping this. Let y'all see. Um, not the Dollar Tree, but bam, right there it is. Max Videos, man. That Max Video Game, man. That, that's a, uh, that's the uh, retro spot. Sorry if it was a little blurry, but you know I'm in the car, and it's been raining. Um, but I forgot to hit y'all up with a video while I'm just sitting here uh, taking tape off of things. So I got it. I got the uh, double press. Um, it's kind of a little a little grimy, just a little bit, but it's the double press by City and Three. Um, it's a little grimy because you can see the tape right here is coming off. But I mean, it's it's not bad. It is black label. Both of them have the manuals. Um, Vi uh, three has the uh, poster. Vice City did not. What are you gonna do? I, I mean, come on. I can't complain too much. If I buy the uh, PS2 version, I'll get the fucking poster. If I buy two copies of them, I'm gonna get two posters. Give one of them to the Xbox. It's not like there's a difference in the posters. Um, outside the fact that the uh, back part here is coming up, there's really not much more I can say about it. It's in really good condition. Um. Then again, I have a stack here. Yes, I get stacks because if you buy two, they give you two for free. Um, when you buy the under 10, I paid 20 for that one. So, I mean, it was $10 pop. I'm not gonna be mad at that. Um, up first, we have Conflict Desert Storm 2. I have both of them now. After that, we have Lego Star Wars. Apparently, uh, Lego Star Wars, it's got the episode one, two, and three on this one. I never played them. Um, that'll give me a chance to play them. I'm not really looking forward to, you know, much interaction with them. Because, y'all know me, man. I'm I'm more into the Batman games. Like, the Batman uh, Arkham games. Or even the Lego Batman games. Because I played all those. Um, and that's just me. I'm, I'm more of a Batman fanatic. So, up next we have Metal Gear Solid 2 Substance. Um, honestly, I'm not a Substance type of person. I'm the Sons of Liberty player i've beat sons of liberty i can beat this game in like four hours to just tell you the truth um it's still fuck konami all day but uh the it's konami's right there but it's going in the collection i need it for the collection if i buy konami games and they're going to be used and they're not going to see profit from me buying konami games um after that we have a ghost recon 2 this is not summit strike i have summit strike but now we have the uh, ghost recon 2 um, 2011 Final Assault, that's what that says up top. So I'm guessing this is the original Ghost Recon uh, 2. Now I have this to add to the extensive list of Ghost Recon 2 games. And then lastly, we have 50 Cent's Bulletproof. Back when 50 Cent and G-Unit were the top of the rap game. Um, I'm not really going to play this, to be honest with you, I'm not. And um the reason i have it again is just for the collective purpose of me building this collection so the video i made yesterday said i had 70 games so 75 77 games now sit in this xbox collection um 77 deep in this one collection of mine um that's a big number for me, man. I've never owned 77 games on any system. I think the most I've ever owned at one point was maybe 15. That's including this system, the Nintendo 64. Yes, even this system. I've owned at one point only 15. So 77, a complete inbox console. The headset, about five controllers. Um, the actual big giant controller itself, yes, I have that. I actually play with that controller when I'm playing on my original Xbox. Um, and I'm looking to, you know, invest in more consoles. Like, I'm actually going to purchase the green console, the blue console, that, that's the Halo 2 console. Um, I'm actually looking to invest in the hard-to-find consoles, if I can find them for a reasonable price. I'm not paying over a grand for... Panzera Dragoon Orta's console. The fuck is wrong with y'all? That shit, no, bitch, no. I don't think that's worth no grand. That's like it's saying that that system alone is worth more than every console on the market. That console is dead. That console has no ability to do anything anymore. That console is not worth a grand, even to collectors, no. 
Um, I'm looking for that orange one that the employees only got. Yes, I'm looking for that one as well. So I'm out here, you know, riding around these streets. I'm not driving right now because I don't have it set up to where I can actually do that this time. So I'm giving you all this video. I'm sitting here, sitting still. Um, and that's what I picked up. Like I said, I'm out here. Y'all can see I'm do the live shot right there. That's Max Video Games. That's where I get my. That's where I get this at. Um, just in case y'all was ever wondering, I, I do support the uh, retro shops, and that's where I go to get my retro shop on. Where I go to get these type of games at. Um, they're very cool in there, and definitely support all your local mom and pops retro stores, man. They are way better than all these you know starbucks corner shop you know game stops and bullshit like that um but until next time man definitely deuces